Welcome back to the Lights Out podcast. Bedtime stories for boys and girls for when the lights go out. Good evening, boys and girls. Are you ready for bed? Are you all snuggled up and ready for another Lights Out bedtime story? Well, you're in for a treat tonight because tonight's story is called The Great Paper Caper by one of my all time favorite authors. Oliver Jeffers. And a big shout out to all the listeners and readers who support the Ad Free Forever Thousand Stories at Bedtime mission. Our mission here at the Lights Out Podcast is a thousand ad free bedtime stories. A big shout out to all the followers and fans on Spotify, Apple, and everywhere else for supporting the Ad Free Forever show for children around the world to listen to at bedtime. Another big shout out to all the awesome authors who support the show through their donations. Okay, once upon a time, there was a time. In the forest. When everything was not as it should have been. Everyone who lived there had been noticing strange things. Branches, they agreed, should not disappear from trees like that. Someone, they agreed, again, must be stealing them. And they each in turn blamed the other. But they all had a solid alibi, which meant it couldn't possibly be them. So the tree thief must be someone else. It was all very mysterious indeed. An investigation was launched to get to the bottom of things. They were each given a different job to do. So the tree thief could be caught. I'll be the detective and you can be the judge. Why do I have to be the judge? Why not him? I'm the prosecutor, that's why. They took photographs, made notes, and examined every leaf. But no matter how hard they investigated, no clues. Could be found. Hmm. Then an eyewitness report led them to some evidence that had blown in not far away, and it had the bear's paw prints all over it. Hello, police! They had found their culprit. The bear was brought in to have his picture taken, and it was kept late into the night to answer questions. Where were you that night? The next day, he confessed everything in court, all about the paper aeroplane competition and how badly he wanted to win, and he knew he wasn't very good, and he had run out of paper, and he had no one to ask for help. He was so sorry for taking their trees without asking. He hadn't meant to do so much harm. This court is adjourned. Hmm. Well, all right, they all thought. But he'd have to make it up to them by replacing the trees. And the paper plane competition, indeed? That sounds interesting. The bear kept his word. And made it up to them. And as the others helped him gather up the old paper planes, they had an idea. They put them all together and made a new one. The end. Wow, what a great story! And another book by the awesome Oliver Jeffers. You have to see it to believe it. And that was the great paper caper here on the Lights Out podcast, bedtime stories for 
boys and girls like you. Good night.